yes fitness family welcome back it's been a while since we put out a vlog on the channel let's go to falasa now at this time around i'm not taking you to nude beaches and all of that but i want to show you hotels and all of that okay hotels apartments studio apartments rooms for rent and whatnot so if you're looking to stay around falasana area so you can enjoy the sunset the beach and all of what comes with it stay tuned watch this video through to the end because i have juicy juicy information to give to you if you watch halfway and leave you are going to miss out on all the goodies i have to give all right so right now i'm streaming this particular video talking to you guys because i wanted this vlog to be as raw as possible but the noise like falasana is very windy so have that in mind if you're actually going to falasana have that in mind that it's windy so i had to do a voiceover after listening the, to the video and the sound of the wind it was just too much to for you to understand what i was saying so i decided to just mute and do a voiceover that being said right here you see i'm just coming from the beach right now okay going back to my car and i decided okay why don't i use this opportunity to show you the studio apartments and hotels and whatnot that is around this area because some persons or should i say some or lots of persons like you saw the parking lot it's filled with different cars a lot of people drive from far far away just to get to falasana because you have beach like falasana elafoni sea and balos these are the famous beaches you will hear if you're on this part of crete uh island so when you ask people where should i go they will always suggest falasana and uh, they will suggest Elafoni Sea, they will suggest Balos because they have beautiful beaches. But if you want, if you've already heard about this area and you want to stay closer to this area and driving from Falasana to Elafoni Sea and Balos is also not far. So it's a good spot if you're renting your hotel or getting a room around this area. Okay. So I'm showing you uh, the hotels and apartments that are closer to the beach. And if you look off to the mountain tops area, you see other hotels also. So you have the option of renting from the ones that are up there. You see those, they look small, they look like small buildings, but trust me, they are big, big hotels up there, but it's like up on the mountain because if you've seen my previous vlog, then you, I, I actually showed when we're doing the descending, coming down from the mountain and descending down to the beach. But right now I'm filming from down on the beach so you can see the mountain at the top. All right. So depending on what you want, but let me quickly add this. All of the hotels around this Falasana area, this artist, they all have beautiful sunset view. So you're not even going to say, oh, wow, if I stay in a or i stay in b i'm not going to get the sunset that a has or b has you're going to have beautiful sunset view wherever or whichever hotel or studio apartment you choose and another thing i love about this particular area is the fact that they have a little bit of everything okay if you're someone that you're really boxed up you have a lot of cash you have a lot of money to spend you've been saving for a long time you just you want to just do it large they have those type of hotels okay with swimming pools and everything that you need but if you're like a student that like you're also just wanting to travel and have some fun yourself and your friends and stuff like that and you don't have so much money with you you also have studio apartments you have rooms for rent which are not as expensive as those five star hotels and you know two three uh, sorry five star four and a half stars and three star hotels okay but i love the fact that it is all mixed up and everybody gets to get something and the locals are very helpful they have restaurants for the food you are sure that you're going to get absolutely good food because trust me most of the restaurants that you will go to are owned by locals and most of the food are prepared from farm to you know back to the uh but if you but if you love fast food also because i hardly talk about fast food but yes i get to see people running around with things like pizza burger and the rest of those stuff so they those things are also available to you something else i want to add also falasana is a beach that is open and it is um it is like everybody is accepted in falasana actually in the country so if you are straight you're not straight you are you know bring around with your partner and all of that you want to just chill and look for a place to chill where you feel like yes 
let's just wind down and relax and do our thing you will find a good spot in falasana where you can find the lgbtq people the area they love to just hang out and do their thing feel free you can see them doing their thing you know what i mean i cannot tell you all about so it just depends on what you are going for you also find like straight couples out there doing their thing and they also have the areas where you have the sun beds and whatnot where you can go with family with children and there's there's just a little bit of everything for everyone okay so whatever you're looking forward to and having that evening walk or morning walk you know some persons love trust me exercise is very important okay if you're not exercising you have to okay so i also have to include that so if you're looking to go for like morning walk afternoon walk some people do the afternoon walk but please get your water with you and please don't walk too far because the weather right now the heat wave in greece it is not a joke so if you're doing the afternoon walk keep water close to you and please don't walk too far so should in case you get to pass out somebody can see you and help okay but that being said, if you're going for morning walks and uh, evening walk, you're going to so love it. It is super windy. So even with the heat, you kind of feel like, okay, this is it. And if you love, you know, a lot, a lot of people just want to tan, allow the sun to just beat their body and all of that. So if you're going for your walk, you're really going to love it. That's you and nature and all that nature has to give. The beautiful beaches with turquoise water. There's a lot of space. So you can go to the supermarket and you can pick up umbrellas, pick up your drinks and snacks, whatever you need at the beach and just go down to the beach, set up your umbrella. That is if you don't want to go to where you have all the touch houses and where you can you know pay like let's say two euro per bed uh to get a, a sun bed and listen to music with the djs and all of that you can get your umbrella go down to the beach set up your umbrella set up your little area and just do what you have to do with you your partner your friends your family your whomever you're traveling with so that is also available to you. And that's one thing I love about Falasana, that everybody don't need to be, uh, you know, packed in a small area because we have some areas that you people really love going to. And when you get there, it is super, super packed where you see people lying down all naked and this person's uh, whatever is next to the other one's face. And like everybody's all squeezed up just because the area is so beautiful. But there are millions and millions of beautiful places that you can go to but some people just love those areas that are packed and if you're not a fan of packed area then falasana it, it is the place for you okay falasana is the place for you to go to because you will find a beautiful spot and some of the areas you don't even need an umbrella you will find these little trees that grows by the beach side and they make a little bit of shade where you just throw your towel underneath the tree and you just chill and have your picnic there go for a swim you get out of the water you can lay down there to sun bathe if you want you just take your towel from underneath the tree put it out where the sun can uh touch your body and you just sun bathe for as long as you want it's just so much so i just wanted to let you know that they also have like studio apartments they have um restaurants they have um supermarket and uh what else what else what else do you need if you want to buy the traditional products and all of that you will see them you see like this one right here is called the falasana bay and you see how close to the beach this falasana bay apartment is okay so you can rent one like this and if i would walk up to the mountain area i can show you several apartments and they are even building more so come next year you will even have more apartments and uh, all of that so thank you so very much for watching and uh, see you on the next one thank you